Hello, my pals. As you know, we've been waiting for this since last year. And finally, the move we've all been anticipating has happened. Microsoft has officially acquired Activision Blizzard. We're on a level we couldn't have imagined a few years ago. Check out this epic video from Xbox welcoming Activision Blizzard. Troll and Barok, or heroes, are here saying this is now our home. Microsoft adopted us, my bros. Home. Family. This moment is special not only for us, WoW addicts, but for the entire Blizzard family, from StarCraft to Overwatch, through Diablo and more. And believe me, we deserve it. The journey hasn't been easy. As WoW players, we've gone through tough years. 2021, in particular, brought us not only in-game challenges, but also internal issues at Blizzard. Add to that the inconsistencies of Shadowlands, and we had what I can describe as one of the worst moments in the history of World of Warcraft. To the point that some would say it was worse than the time of the Warlords of Draenor expansion. I even went so far as to think being in a world player was the worst nightmare, exaggerating just a bit. But here we are, my friends, in a new chapter. The acquisition by Microsoft of Activision Blizzard bring us hope and I would say a well-deserved breather. Let's hope things improve, you know, for better or for worse. But what's clear is that we rid ourselves of some problematic executives at Activision Blizzard, and that's a huge relief. Now we have our own Phil Spencer from Xbox in charge, and in Blizzard's case, Mike Ibarra is holding steady. And well, the good news keeps coming for WoW. The new 11.0 expansion is on the way, and to the surprise of many, the legendary Chris Metzen is back. This month, Phil Spencer shares some words about all of this. You can check it out on the Xbox Play. Microsoft is officially welcoming Activision Blizzard and their legendary gaming franchises to Team Xbox. The collaboration aims to bring beloved games to more platforms, including the Game Pass. Phil Spencer expresses admiration for their impact on gaming culture and promises an inclusive gaming community. Cloud streaming for Activision Blizzard games in the European Economic Area is underway and plans for Game Pass availability are in progress. The message emphasizes a commitment to players and a future filled with new experiences and possibilities. I highlight the letter for the exciting possibility of Game Pass in WoW. Although it's not confirmed, it could be a reality that all fans would be thrilled to see. Overall, I firmly believe that these changes will be the best for all of us. While I understand that some people might have doubts or concerns about Microsoft, I am convinced that this new phase will bring significant benefits. I'd like to talk about Bobby Kotick, a controversial figure who will leave Blizzard on January 1st of next year. And although his departure comes with a significant sum of money, around $300 million or even more, his sexy represents a new beginning. With Microsoft acquisition, I have hopes that not only past issues such as content cuts due to rush releases will be resolved, but we'll also see an era of greater stability and quality in our gaming experiences. I genuinely believe that these changes will mark a brighter and more exciting chapter for the Blizzard community. And well, that's it for now, my bros. What do you think about the changes at Blizzard? Are you excited, indifferent, or do you have any concerns? What do you expect Microsoft to bring to WoW and the other games? Do you think they'll include it in the Game Pass? Share your opinions in the comments. I wish you all the best, have a great time. Until next time, my bros.